Hello students, welcome to the next lecture on the differential equation. Today we will see how you can find the solutions of this second order differential equation when the one solution is given to you. So what is the objective of that? We will see like here if this is the differential equation which is given to you and the one solution is y1 is given to you. Then how you can find the second solution of this problem? This is this example is discussed in example number one. Similarly, we will discuss the several others are there. Some have a constant coefficients, some has a variable coefficient, some has a solution of the sine log and so on. So how we can solve these problems, we will see in this short video. Myself, Dr. Gurk, working in the School of Mathematics Thapar Institute. You can contact me either of my email IDs, else simply follow this link for finding these various videos. So as we know that the second order differential equation has the two solutions, one is called as the y1 and second is y2. Assume we have the one solution y1 which is the u of x is given to you. What is the meaning of that? It must satisfy the equation number 1. That is u double dash plus of this are there. Now our general solution of this equation number 1 is c1 of y1 that is a u plus c2 of a. Our target is to find the value of this y2. So assume that y2 is nothing but the product of this u and v so that the, the y1 and y2 are your linear independence are there. So this must satisfy this here. Now when whenever y is the solution of 1, it means you have it must satisfy the given equations. So we will calculate the y dash of here. We will calculate the y double dash from this we will here. Now substitute this y dash and y double dash in this equation number 1. We will get this equation. Now we can equate the coefficients. We will get this equation as of here this plus I can equate the coefficient of the v dash and here. What is the value of this is? You can see that this is nothing but my 0. So we can substitute here. Now our target is to find the value of the v from here. You can equate them. You can separate them. Now once you will integrate them on both sides, what will happen on the left hand side? This is nothing but my, what is that? This is nothing but my log of v dash. What is that? This is nothing but my log of u and so on. And I can write this minus of 2 on the left hand side and can be written as of the log of u square. This quantity can be written as like this way. This logarithm can be taken on this exponential side and the value of the v dash is here. Since what is the d v dash is nothing but the dv by dx. So I can find the value of v by integrating on both sides. So this is the formula, this is the v. So hence our second root, second equation is u into v. So once you will multiply them, you will get the required answer as of this. How you can implement this in, in your numerical example, we will see with the help of the 5 here. This is the first example that's a very simple are there in which the first equation is given, first solution is given to you as here. You can compare this differential equation and find the value of the p. What is the value of the p from here is minus of 4. Now one solution is given to you that means u is given to you as of here. Once you are finding the value of u, the general solution will be c1 of the first solution plus c2 of this and your target is to find the value of y2 which is nothing but u into v. So our goal is to find the value of this v. How you find the value of v? We can use this formula. I can substitute the value of u here. I can substitute the value of the p is my minus of 4. You can get here. What is that? This is nothing but my e raised to power 4x. This e raised to power 4 and this e raised to power 4 will be cancelled out. So the integration is my x. So therefore you can substitute the value here. y2 will be my this. Hence you can substitute this value of y2 here. So the general solution is my this. Look at the second example are there in which uh, x square ln x is given to you as one solution. The given differential equation is my here. You can compare this and can find the value of the p. Make sure that the coefficient of the y double dash need to be 1. So you can divide it by x square. Now p is given to you here. This is my first solution that is a u is given to you. You can write the first solution as the c1 of first solution plus c2 of y2 where y2 is nothing but my u into v. u is given to you as of this and the value of the v can be found from here. You can substitute the value of the u square. u is my nothing but what is the u is x square log x. So this is x raised to power 4 nlx of square e raised to power minus of this. Now what is the integration of this side is? This is nothing but my 3 ln f of x. You can solve this. What is the expression of this? I can write this as either you can write as a log or this is nothing but here which is of x cube. So once it is x cube, this is x4, 1 will be cancelled out, this is here. How you can solve that? 
you can easily take ln x as a as a say z so what is that 1 by x of dx is nothing but dz so what is that this is nothing but dz upon z square so what is the answer of this this is nothing but minus 1 by z that is minus 1 by here and therefore once you will get a u as minus l by x you can substitute here y2 is nothing but x square you can substitute the value of y2 here you will get the required solution as of this either it can be taken as a minus of c2 or plus c2 both have the same meaning look at the another example which is of here again you can see the coefficient of the y square is not p1 so you can firstly divide it by x square on both sides so you will get the p as here your first solution is given to be here you can write the second general solution as of this where y2 is nothing but u into v where v is written as here you can substitute the value of p you can substitute the value of the u and you will get this expression here what is that this is nothing but ln x you can write like here now this is a x so one x will be cancelled out how you can solve that again very simple you can substitute ln x of this as say z so what is that this is 1 by x dx is nothing but my dz so this expression will be my 1 upon sine square z of dz what is that this is nothing but my cosecant square of z what is the answer of this this is nothing but my minus of cot z r there you can see i can take ln x of this uh, here you will get as minus of cos z so z is nothing but ln x so once you will get this as a v you can substitute here you will get the y2 once it's a cot you can see this is nothing but my cos ln x divided by sine ln x x so if you multiply this by here so one sine x will be cancelled out minus x cos x will be here so therefore you can substitute this value here you will get either you can take as a minus of c2 or as a plus of c2 that's the same problem look at the another one is there again you can see the coefficient of the y double dash is not p1 so you have to firstly divide them here now the p is nothing but my this one solution is given as a x plus 1 so c1 of y1 plus c2 of y2 where y2 is nothing but my of this i can find the value of the v from here you can substitute the value of the u that is x plus 1 whole square of what is the p p is nothing but my here now can you solve this integration if you take 1 minus 2x minus of x square as a z what is the derivative of this this is minus of this is nothing but my so what is that this is minus is also be there minus 2 of this so this expression is nothing but my this is nothing but my dz upon z that is e raised to power ln x or log of this so you can get as a z that is of here this is nothing but the derivative so how you can integrate them so since this is x plus 1 this is the degree of both are same you can see the degree of numerator and degree of denominator are same so you must divide them so i can add plus 1 here and minus 1 here so that this becomes the x plus 1 whole square so i can add plus 1 and minus of 2 now you can separate them what will happen this is 1 of dx this is minus minus plus 2 is constant this is here so what is that this is nothing but minus of x so what is the answer of this this is nothing but x plus 1 of minus 2 plus 1 upon minus 2 plus 1 so you can see these answers are there now you will get as a v is this once you will get v you can substitute here x plus 1 if you multiply them what will be the y2 this is minus x of x plus 1 this will be cancelled out minus of 2 is there so you can substitute here you can write either you can take x minus common then it's again the same solution look at the last example are there again this is x4 is there you can fi firstly find this uh, coefficient as a 1 you will get a p is nothing but my minus 7 by x first solution is given to you as x4 and the second solution is given as here you can find the value of the v from uh, this one you can solve it easily you will get as the expression as of log x so therefore v is my log x so y2 is nothing but my x raised to power 4 log of x so therefore your solution will be my here so this is the way you can solve the differential equation when you have the one uh, solution is given to you we will see in our next class how you can solve the cauchy euler equation when what is the cauchy euler equation is whenever there is a x square it's a y double dash phi x 
is a y dash. Similarly, if it is x cube, then it's a third order derivative and so on. How you can solve this problem when uh, in, in the differential equation, we will see in our next class. Till then, you can simply follow this link for finding the various videos on these mathematics subjects. Best of luck students. Happy learning.